My name is Lynn Smeaton. I'm secretary of the Recycle Teenagers. But my role covers quite a lot of jobs, not just secretary. Jean Emery, and I've been coming to this club for the last six and a half years. My name is Sue, and I've been coming to the Recycle Teenagers for this time round five years. Last time, from the moment it started. The Recycle Teenagers Club is the club for the elderly of the Britwell and surrounding communities. Uh, we're here to stop isolation in the elderly, to help with physical, mental, emotional health, adding years to life, life to years, giving them somewhere to make friends. We actually started as the Recycle Teenagers Club on the 1st September 2010. Yeah, the amount of members we have is about 109 members. It means friendship, uh, companionship, stops me from being isolated, and uh, fun. Because um, I was lonely at home. I've got a husband at home that's, you know, I have to look after and that, but this is my day out. And only for this club, I don't know what I would have done. It's really great, this club is, you know. The activities that the Recycled Teenagers do we do the lunch club on a Wednesday, a coffee morning on a Monday with chair exercise, coffee on a Friday morning with hoy. We also take them on trips throughout the summer to various, they have about eight trips out. We do a lovely Christmas lunch. And we take about 50, 52 on holiday for once a year for a week. And dances, and we've got dances Saturday night. So we try and do as much activity as we can for them, get them out and about. Oh, Lynn, she's great. She's one of the best. She is one of the best. She works hard and she's always there in the morning. She makes you feel like as if you've known her for years and she's always there to greet you. You can't, she can't do enough for you, Lynn. She's really, really good, Lynn is. Oh, she, she'll do anything for anybody. She is so cheerful and happy and makes things worthwhile. She's one of the reasons why I keep coming. Well, I do it because I like helping people, making a difference to their lives. And I think with the age group, with the elderly, a lot of them gave up their youth for us. And it's nice to give them something back in their old age.